who could join the Akatsuki. If your faves in the Naruto series could have joined the Akatsuki, which of them would you expect to be a potential candidate for the organization? Maybe Kakashi or Shikamaru would have actually been good members of the Akatsuki. Stick with me and don't be confused, in today's video, we will be exploring the people who we think would have made good members of the Akatsuki. But before I go on, don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe to our YouTube channel. The first thing we should explore is who were the Akatsuki and what was their goal as an organization. Akatsuki literally means dawn or daybreak and they were a group of shinobi that existed outside the usual system of hidden villages in the Naruto-verse. Originally, the purpose of this organization was to seek world peace and even as they took on different forms and leaders throughout the course of the series, this was still the major goal but it was through their own means which made them viewed as criminals. I have to admit, the Akatsuki was kind of a cool and powerful organization although they were villains. And well, a lot of anime fans tend to compare them with villains from other anime like the Espada and Bleach and for me, the Akatsuki will solo the Espada. But before you get carried away, let's look deeper into the history of the Akatsuki. Yahiko's Akatsuki as we all know, the Akatsuki was the brainchild of Yahiko, Konan, and Nagato who were orphaned by the Second Great Shinobi World War in the village of Amigakure, and they were also once students of Jiraiya Sensei. The organization was founded during the Third Great Ninja World War and the plan of the Akatsuki was to bring peace to their home country which, very often than ever, were always involved in crossfire of the Five Great Shinobi Villages conflicts. After existing for a while, Tobi in disguise of Madara approached the orphans and claimed that Nagato was the reincarnation of the Sage of Sex Paths and that he could teach him to control his power, the Renegade. Yahiko however distrusted him and wanted nothing to do with him. But later on, Tobi would claim to be the one who encouraged Yahiko to form the Akatsuki. Because of their desire to end the war, many Ame Shinobi decided to join the cause. But they however ended up having issues with Hanzo, the village head who was threatened by them. Yahiko ended up committing suicide and a lot of their members died, leaving only Nagato and Konan. Apparently, this was not the end of the organization as they forged ahead with a new leader, Nagato. Nagato's Akatsuki Nagato was entrusted with the mission of bringing peace to the world by Yahiko with his dying breath. Pained by the death of Yahiko, Nagato would go ahead to believe that the world would never willingly consent to peace. He then decided to use more brutal force and destruction to get the shinobi world to submit to the organization. Nagato then started using the alias Pain and formed the six paths of Pain in which he used Yahiko's corpse so that he could symbolically continue leading the Akatsuki. Nagato then sought out Obito and accepted his earlier offer. Under Nagato, they started recruiting s rank missing men while arming them and promising protection to carry out their respective goals. While Orochimaru and Itachi joined for their personal reasons, Zetsu and Kisame joined to ensure the realization of the infinite Tsukuyomi plan. This dispensation of the Akatsuki had a three-step plan to achieve their goals. One was to obtain money to support the organization, two was to provide mercenary services so that they could get more money and also get villages to depend on them to do their dirty jobs. And lastly, once all the major shinobi forces have dissolved, Akatsuki would gain prominence and conquer the world. We all know what went down at the end. Akatsuki lost many of their members and Nagato ended up dying also while Konan opted to leave the organization. Tobi's Akatsuki we see Tobi following the initial plan of Madara which was to bring about infinite Tsukuyomi and casting the Genjutsu on the entire world thereby ending the conflict by trapping everyone in their own dreams. We also see Sasuke's formed Taka group having an alliance with Tobi's Akatsuki to capture the eight-tailed beast. Tobi ends up declaring war on the entire five shinobi nations. Having seen all this, I now wonder would the Akatsuki have survived if they have recruited more worthwhile shinobi? That being said, there are a number of ninjas that the group would have recruited if they had the chance. Minato's speed would have been perfect for capturing Jinjutikis. I have to say, Minato joining the Akatsuki would have been a huge bonus to the organization. But since Minato was the Hokage of the Hidden Leaf Village, it's most unlikely that he would never have ever joined the Akatsuki. He was one of the strongest ninjas that the Leaf Village has ever trained and was also regarded as the fastest ninja in history. 
The very fact that Minato modified and mastered the Flying Thunder God technique, which he could use to teleport instantly while using a kunai marked with the Jutsu formula, would have been a great addition to the numerous skills that the Akatsuki had. This technique made him so feared that the villagers issued a flee on sight orders. He could have used this speed to capture a Jinjuriki in the blink of an eye. If you ask any Naruto fan if they like Kabuto, the answer would most likely be no. Even I would say no. And why is this? Because he willingly served Orochimaru and the duo performed a number of heinous acts together. After a while of working with Orochimaru, Kabuto was found by the Akatsuki and turned into one of the spies for Sasori. And being a spy is what Kabuto was very good at because he possessed a high level of intellect and also performed a number of experiments that made him an expert in body modification. Although Kabuto ended up working, Kabuto with, the ended up working with the under the leadership of Tobi to start the fourth great Ninja World War, if under they the leadership of Tobi to him much earlier, fourth great Ninja World War, if they had actually ship of Tobi to start the Ninja, but. Oh well, he did help out by reanimating dead shinobis to provide a whole army of foot soldiers for Tobi's war. Pakura's court but, style would oh have well, helped he against did help Jinjurikis. Do you remember Pakura of the Hidden Sand Village, who was Sand Village, who renowned was for her Keke Genkai, the Scorch style? For her, she was considered a she hero was cons after she style. guarded the Stone Village considered plant. A hero However, she was killed during an ambush by Cloud Ninjas, in which she cursed her village because they set her up for it. Per adventure she had survived this ambush, she would have made a good weapon in the arsenal of the Akatsuki if they had recruited her by exploiting her newfound hatred against the Sand Village. Plus, her Keke Genkai which allowed her to create heat orbs would have been perfect for capturing Jinjurikis as these orbs actually evaporate all moisture in the human body making it easier to take them down. Tsunade's medical expertise and strength would have been medical an expertise asset. and Tsunade strength was would not have just been the fifth Hokage of the Hidden Leaf, but the granddaughter of Fashirama and strength Senju. Fashirama she Senju. And strength and would have been life an as she lost Fashirama her younger brother during the she second did she war lost her and younger also brother during she loved. If she had actually joined the Akatsuki during this war period, she they would have gained a very her powerful younger brother ninja during. who was very skilled in medical ninjutsu. She could have easily beaten a tail during this beast warring with her fists. And the she could very have fact easily that beaten a tail beast with her fists would have helped the organization in terms of when they beaten a tail beast with her fists. As organization in terms of when medical with her fists. Shikamaru's mind would have guaranteed the Akatsuki success. Shikamaru is a very popular organization in, in terms Naruto of when they sustained the kind of injuries of during a fight as possessed. they didn't have a single I mean, medical hey, Even I would have loved for him to join my organization yes. because of this. Shikamaru's His strategic mind has come in handy multiple times and with it, he served the 6th and 7th Hokage, Kakashi and Naruto respectively. Although the Akatsuki had intelligent members like Itachi, but if they had actually recruited Shikamaru, their plan to capture Tail Black Beast he possessed. would have definitely I mean, gone hey, a lot even I smoother. Also, his ability to manipulate shadows because he belonged to the Nara clan would have definitely been a great asset for the Akatsuki. Shisui Uchiha joining the Akatsuki would have greatly he gone a lot them. smoother. And why do I say so? Clan would have That's definitely very been much a great asset only for the Akatsuki. The Sharingan eye, but she was exceptionally skilled in using it. He also gone a lot the body smoother flicker technique, and he was considered clan by many would have fans definitely been a great to be asset one of for the, the most talented Uchiha in history. If Shisui had joined the Akatsuki, had joined he would the have Akatsuki, proved to be a great asset to them as his Sharingan was widely sought after be a that Danzo had to seal one of his eyes from him. But after Shisui that was able Danzo to use Koto Matsukami, which was a very powerful genjutsu that allowed him to enter an individual's mind and controlled them to think that it was a result of their own free will which made it very effective for mind control. Shisui was this able to use the Akatsuki to be less stressed in capturing genjutsu as all they needed to do was place them under Koto Amatsukami and be controlled to follow them without any fights. Neji, a prodigy of the Byakugan. Neji, a made prodigy a of the himself by being a significant being character a significant in, the series. Series. in the first half of the Not series. Not only was he a very talented ninja, but he had a very interesting backstory. Ninja, but in the first half of the series, the first half of the series. Backstory. Backstory. why we fans wanted to see more of him. 
Although he belonged to the branch family of the Yuga clan, he was however a prodigy of the Byakugan and he mastered several high-level techniques. More of him. He could effectively Although he fight as he could see through the walls and also see the chakra network of a person. Fight as he could he see the chakra network. He could effect the spell and that allowed also him to effectively fight as Yuga could see through the walls. He could effectively if fight as him to deflect the attacks because and cut off a person's he chakra. He also master the special Yuga. He could effectively fight as Yakatsuki because of how. What are your opinions on these characters joining Akatsuki? Do you think they would have been a great asset to the organization? You can go in the comment section below to share your thoughts. You can also watch our video on how Kakashi joined the Akatsuki and ended up betraying Konoha. Thank you for watching and see you next time.